Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm going to be cleaning my master bedroom. As you can see, it is a wreck. Part of the reason is because we do not have rods or shelves in our closet when we bought the house. That closet was completely empty. And so we're working on putting the rods and shelves in the closet so everything needed to come out of there. been doing laundry so now I've got to get that and put that where it belongs. And here I'm just making my bed. It is amazing how much cleaner a room can look just by making the bed. So I do have quite a few blankets on here because I tend to get really cold. But my bedspread, if anybody is wondering, that is from Bed Bath & Beyond I believe. So I have that, and then the throw pillows, I got clearance at Target, the gray ones, as well as the cream polka dotted one in the middle. The one with the eyelashes, I got that one at JCPenney. That one was also clearance. This is what we use as my husband's nightstand, and seriously, Getting all that stuff out of the closet, everything was everywhere. There's no reason why that should have been at the foot of the bed. So right now, I'm just cleaning it out and throwing away things that doesn't need to be there, as well as setting the books up. So this container you see me bringing in, what I did was I cleared off the surfaces of this vanity here, which houses my hair stuff, my makeup, some of my undergarments, things like that. And I cleared off the white dresser that you will see in a second and put that all in the container so I could put it away later, so I could quickly deep clean my bedroom. As you can see, some of the handles are missing from this dresser. This dresser my dad bought for my room when I was eight. So I do want to redo it, but I didn't want to get rid of it and I just have not had time to redo it yet. But I'm looking forward to that project coming up soon, so stay tuned for that. And here I am vacuuming my bedroom. This is a very easy vacuum to use. I don't like that it is so big, but it does help with my allergies. It is a rainbow vacuum. It doesn't use a filter. The water is actually the filter. So I really do like that about it. dust my ceiling fan and I do need to take the long stick attachment piece off to be able to thoroughly get into the fan but it does work really well without getting the dust all over my bed I do like that about it and so then I just go around the bedroom and vacuum around the corner edges where the ceiling and the wall meets so I can get all of the cobwebs if there are any and any dust that may be settling up there I'm 
I'm going ahead and giving my bedroom a good mop. I'm using the Rubbermaid Reveal Mop and I really like it because you can use your own cleaner. I have Mrs. Myers and the basil scent in there. It's just the concentrate. So I add just a little bit of that with mostly water and I do like that it has removable washable pads on that mop as well. So now I'm going to go ahead and clean my bathroom. I like to start with putting the toilet bowl cleaner in first so that it can set while I am cleaning everything up. And I do have a bad habit of leaving all of my hair products on the counter. I usually put lots of stuff away. Now my hair products and things like that, not so much. So my husband is very nice and not really saying anything about my stuff being all over the counter. This is the only place where I am quite a bit of a slob as far as the house goes is in the bathroom itself. So I'm just going to clean the mirror here. The spray that I have, I just reused that bottle. That was one of the Mrs. Myers and the peppermint scent, but I reused it because I have that basil concentrate. I've noticed it saves me a lot of money because really you only need one and a half teaspoons of the concentrate into the bottles and fill the rest with water and it's diluted just perfectly. So after this, I went ahead and cleaned the shower. I kind of cut that out because you couldn't really see it. In my bathroom, the, the size it is is very small and the angle is kind of weird, so you wouldn't have been able to see me clean the shower anyway. So I just kind of skipped over that part and then just started cleaning the toilet. vacuum cleaner again it is the easiest way to get everything I feel like I don't quite get any everything when I'm sweeping but with this vacuum I for sure feel like I'm getting everything up off the floor and then after I vacuum then I'm gonna go ahead and get that mop and mop the floor as well Okay hey guys, well that does it. Thank you so much for watching and if you like cleaning videos, please give this a big thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below so you don't miss any of my videos. Bye.